one of my, my body bearers, um, the Native American, Thomas Saunders, is pushed into the line as a scout, and he scouts up into the early position, in the nearly position to penetrate the wire again. But these are just some of the stories that are in the book. And I think, I think Saunders is an extraordinary story. He, he um, receives the French Quarter Guerre uh, and the attack at Blancamont Ridge, where he has to go against a very fixed position um, uh, that the Germans have, have uh, at the end of this field. And uh, Native Americans were unfortunately subject to many of the stereotypes during World War II. They were looked at as, um, as Im Im amazing warriors. And in that sense, they were given some of the most difficult combat assignments. And Saunders wasn't an exception. He was given the, this, the assignment of a, a scout in this position, in this, uh, at Blancmont Ridge, but also as a wire cutter to cut the wire and, and use these small handheld wire cutters to breach a hole in the wire to allow the rest of the infantry to go through. And if I go back a little bit, about a month, at San Mihel, he was told to breach the wire there across no man's land. I, I mean, I, I can't even imagine this. Going across no man's land alone with just maybe a partner, 